But check this shit out, man. Now when you're doing that fucking work, man. Now when you do it, I said now when you're doing that landscaping. I be nigga that that all that sugar, bro. You'll get a fucking sugar crash. We we too old for that shit, bro. That sugar still fucks us up. Shit, nigga, I'm a sugar crash in my house. No, exactly. Now when you're at the house, I mean now when you're at work. Yeah, look at that shit, man. Damn, fool, pull the poles out, fool. I'm gonna hope you didn't break that one. That bitch went far. All right, come on, man. Let's do this shit. All right, we got the motherfucking poles in the car. Got some fresh beers in this motherfucker. On our way to Walmart now, so we could go get the uh, get some worms. Woo! Oh, God damn. Yeah, I know. I seen that when I first did that. Uh, I first pulled up so I could get to the trunk. I was like, God damn, I almost went down the whole curb. We gonna go to the Georgetown Lake or which one? Yeah, we have Georgetown so we can make sure we catch something, bro. With that nice ass day. Yeah, Georgetown's pretty nice. Yeah, Georgetown Lake's pretty nice too. There's a gang going though. I didn't know there was that many fishing spots. I'm gonna start. Yeah, you using that fish brain app? Yeah, I'm I told start you. Hitting them bitches up, just seeing where I can catch a different spot. Cherry Creek says they got a thousand catches, but I don't be catching shit on Yeah, Cherry Creek? Fuck Cherry Creek. Yeah, man. I'm trying to hit up something more exclusive, too. That should be a little too fucking overpopulated, overfished and shit. Mm -hmm. Do not recommend Cherry Creek at all for you, boys. Uh, but yeah, so we're on our way to Walmart, man, to go get this fish paid, so. Yeah, like, uh, what was that? Ah, uh, damn it. Like, alright, so I was watching this one ad, man. It wasn't like an ad, but it was like, uh, I don't know how to explain it, bro, but one of them YouTubers type shit. But, uh, the dude was saying, like, he, uh, he was always poor, you know what I mean? He was always, you know what I mean? Everyone has that same mindset when they're poor. It's called the poor man's mentality, you know what I mean? That poor man, poor man's. Poor, poor man thought or whatever the fuck but uh anyway so he was ex-military and shit and he seen that there was shit that the military and upper class men knew and had information on that they just simply would not tell others and kept, and kept it a secret he was like uh he was like he he found out about that uh not mind control but uh yeah, like hy hypnosis shit you know what i mean like when you get hypnotized he was like i looked into all that shit and he was like i seen that the, our government had it you know what i mean and he was uh so he, uh, I guess he saved up his money and shit because he was just in the military. He was like in the lower class military, you know what I mean? But he knew that that shit was there. He had certain friends. So he said he saved up certain money and shit and he, like, bought certain, uh, classified files from them niggas type, type shit. But anyways, he was saying that, like, he used the knowledge of, like, uh, hypnosis and shit to hypnotize himself to keep all the poor man mentality out of his head. And he was like, and, and now he sells it to the public and shit. He was like, I know that there are certain companies and uh, people, uh, certain people and shit, you know what I mean, that doesn't want this out in the public and I'm okay with that if, if anything happens, type shit, you know what I mean? I'm, you know, he knew what was gonna come. Nothing's happened to him yet, but I'm just saying, uh, like. I ain't gonna to him, bro. That's just common knowledge. Yeah, but it's just like, you know, no, but, and, like and, yeah, so, yeah. so like you just said, there's, people know about hypnosis and people know about having poor men mentality but certain people i'm gonna say certain people not like but a lot of people don't know about adding them two together and i could say self uh me personally that was the first that was he was the first uh scammer or fucking motivational speaker or youtube whatever you want to call them motherfuckers he was the first one in my opinion who i've seen connect the two you know what i mean to say i want to program my mind to not think like a fucking broke person you know what i mean and that's what caused him to get the money he's got you know what i mean and i was like damn you know what i mean that's smart but Shit, that's just how it goes though, bro. yeah you gotta you know what i mean Ed, period it's just how it goes you gotta program your mind you know what i mean you gotta not everyone all the time being 
you know, not not everyone thinks like that. Being homeless, of course, is a choice, bro. Yeah, it's how you how the Some fuck. Some people got a shittier end of the stick, but at the end of the day, it's, it's what you do with it. It's still your choice. It's what you do with it, man. Even if you ain't come like got a lot of money, shit, bro, you don't gotta be pouring on the street, my nigga. That's your choice. You can even go to a different state, bro. Where it's cheap, cheap, you know. Cheaper. It's your choice to be homeless and shit. That's your mentality. It's your choice not to have a job. It don't take nothing. You can lie on the resume to get a fucking you know, basic little shit just to get on your feet. That's your choice, bro. There's so much shit you can do. There's like how some people choose to be, you know, I, I'm some sorry people, to say, a jailbird. You know what I mean? People yeah, so that's what I'm gonna say. don't people, blame, don't blame uh, yourself, don't blame the cops for you putting yourself in that situation. Yeah, but some people actually want to be homeless, nigga. Yeah. Because they don't want to pay. Yeah, because you know, yeah, just like that. they're fine with like that, bro, because they feel like, shit, nigga, I'm going to live off the land. There's just some people's view. It's not homeless to everybody, though. Yeah, it's, uh, what's it called? Living, uh, yeah, I can say it's not homeless, it's, uh... Living off the land, nigga, like, no, they don't, uh, don't believe in the government. The niggas don't, they're not finna pay taxes and all that shit. They'd rather damn. live off the grid, bro. There's a certain word for them, motherfuckers. That shit's going off the grid to head. them, niggas. Because if you homeless, you basically kind of dead to a lot of people. Yeah, yeah, if you're homeless, yep, just, just like uh, Top Tier said, man. Uh, if, you're, if, you're, if you're homeless... If you're homeless or in jail, you're dead, basically. <laughs> Period. Yeah, in in, in everyone's eyes, if you're in jail or if you're homeless, you're dead. You know what I mean? And it's sad to say, but it's just the way it goes here. Definitely here in America. Definitely. If you ain't dead, your life's probably dead. A lot of people in your life probably gone. Or... That's just a choice, bro. You really have to get rocked. Yeah, you fucked <laughs> up, bud. Don't be smoking a cigarette and shit. You like man, I'm gonna get paid. You know, <laughs> shit. Nigga, I was gonna just make me have to not work for a couple months. I was gonna say, you know, you stressed out when you only smoke a cigarette, nigga. Mm -hmm. Man, we out here in the uh, boonies again, man. We going out there at the boonies. It's like, no, but uh, we finally up here in the mountains. <clears throat> look at this scenery. This motherfucker shit look beautiful. That's why you love the Colorado, man. But I'm gonna need all you motherfuckers to go back where you came from. <laughs> Cause uh This is my land. This is not your land. Bad <laughs> ass, man. <laughs> For real. But uh yeah, I'll see y'all again here when we get get back up there. This shit, I just had to show y'all the view, man. This shit looks beautiful. Look at the mountains. Look at the camera. Look how look at the look at the uh the footage though. That shit is so crisp. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, deep in that we got we got the push to start up in this motherfucker. You know what I mean? Living our best life. About to get woo, big things coming. You know what I mean? See y'all here in a minute. Oh, Jesse, how is yeah. The boys gotta get the fuck out of this homework before I end up stopping these white folks. These niggas look at me like they ain't never seen a black person before. Man, got me fucked up in this motherfucker. Hey, 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 man, hey. I was taking a piss. That was the longest piss I've ever had. And on top of that, these guys, they might fuck with me crazy. Fuck. Hell no. I'm about to get these worms right here. Grab it. <clears throat> Look at those. What's the difference? No, I think they're actually less than those. They're green. They're green. This one's going here. The ones that I always get that I trust in. What's your name? Your name? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, them is fresh and juicy ones. Yeah, and they all in there. All right, y'all, we Gucci. They actually look empty. That's why I like these. <laughs> I know these niggas be juicy. <laughs> Should we get two or one? Yeah, get two, two of these bitches. 
Oh, well, you gotta open that bitch, see if they juicy. Yeah, you do you, I'm not a You gotta open it, I'm, I got my hands dirty and then... Oh, see, see, take that back. See, that's why I said you gotta open the bitches. That's some good shit right there. Here, look at these ones. That's what she be wormed out. Check them out. What you think? Are they cheaper or what? I don't know. I think they all the same. How much are these worms, bro? Are, they, are these are cheaper? These like, are these cheaper than these ones? Or are they all the same? the same price. Okay. What's the difference in these ones? You don't need the refrigerator. Huh. For whatever reason, I don't have to. <laughs> nah, let's go with the cars. Yeah, get two more of them. They got they got that neon in them. Yeah, they cool. Get some hooks. Little swivels. Pre-made joints. I'm about to get some pre-made shit, just so just to better my chances. Oh, get shit. one, cause I think you already. Nah, I think I might. Some, bro, I already have some. That's what I'm saying. Let's get one just in case. I already have some. I want the swivel. Where the fuck are they at? They're right. Uh, we might need to get this since we're not getting the cooler. Bro, there's a cooler. Get the cooler, bro. It's too hard. No, I don't need a cooler. Oh, that little, that little styrofoam yeah. one? <clears throat> oh, the spinners are right here. I got a good feeling we're going to catch some shit. No, the swivels. They should have the pre-made ones, though. With the swivels attached or what? Yeah, they almost got the little thing. I don't know. I don't think they got the swivels with the pre-attached ones, bro. I think you might have to get these ones. Oh, these ones right here, these swivels. Yeah, I think those are the ones. Alright, fuck it. Think I need that many? Or not? Yeah, because that's it. Let's just get this stuff. Swivels, worms, hooks. That's it, bro, because I already have everything in my toolbox. I mean, in my, uh, in my box. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and yeah, we need, we need to get some beers. Oh, uh, well, I got my, my, my I got my ID. Oh, yeah, period. But they don't ask for my shit, too. Well, I think he's older than me. Most of the time, we just tell him I'm like, well, I'm mean, get some trout, bait, power bait. You trying to get some power bait, bro? I think we should. That's my opinion. Well, fuck. I mean, I kind of swear I have some, but... Uh, what y'all think? What, where should I get it? Oh, no, I just fucked with... With, uh... Ooh! Them, uh, what's it... That's what I got last time. And the motherfuckers do work. We are up in the mountains. Shit, I'm sure there's bass in there too, nigga. Yeah, there's a lot more bass too. So we're just looking for power bait, right? All right, well, fuck it. That's that's one right here. Look, gold trout, trout power bait. Trout master. And cheaper. And cheaper. 
That's all you had to say, my friend. <laughs> you want to hit this one up? Yep. Let's get it. Let's do it. The cooler or what? Now we get the cooler, and we should we be Gucci. 20, I bought 24 of these, and it's all kind of different sizes, so we should be... Oh, that's the uh, variety pack, huh? Mm. Yep. Where's the cooler at? Oh, now we gotta get the cooler and some beers. Where's the cooler at, sir? 7 Eleven got the styrofoam. Excuse me. Oh, right here, Sean. Oh, nope. 274. 274. Scoopy. Let's do it, huh? Where's the lid at? I don't know where the lid is. We don't need no lid. We need a lid. Well, what do we need? Well, then we need to buy ice and some more shit. No, we're just going to put them in there. At least they're in the water if they die, nigga, shit. It's a bad nigga. We did, they're gonna be in the car. The water's gonna be falling everywhere. That's why I said we might as well just throw them in a bag. Let them niggas. Yeah, cause then they could die on our way home. And then when we get home, they'll be dead already. And we could gut them. Nah, I'd rather put them in the cooler, man. You understand? <laughs> <laughs> nigga, shit. I'm gonna just have to buy the cooler so it don't get in my car because we the can bag. Get one for seven eleven if you want. I'm telling you, bro. Cause we're gonna get the bag. I mean. I need the lid. We're gonna, they're gonna be. Yeah. I could just throw my... like four fish in. We get the four I could throw like five fish in a bag. I need two fish. Bro, we could fit like five fish in a bag and throw them in the trunk. And they'll die by the time we get home and we can gut them bitches. You don't have to buy some ice though. Yeah, if we get this. I mean, unless we expect to catch a bunch of fish and throw them in this motherfucker. But with no water or ice. Just in there. See, bro, we can get some ice. We could just throw them in there alive with the ice. Okay. Fuck okay. it. Throw that shit in. Oh, we'll get a separate home. And then we should go buy some beers. This is all the hooks, bro, so. Man, I think she was a dud. She was a dud, but uh, I think they see my homie behind me, man, in a uh, in a Challenger. Just like that, that motherfucker white, that motherfucker nice. Just like that, man, but uh, that shit's wicked. You know what I'm saying? I can't, I can't, I can't even uh, race with my nigga cause my shit's dead as shit. My shit's on low. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, man, but that, that's my, uh, that was my man Lamar. That shit looking nice. Yep. Today was crazy, man. I mean, I can't believe I got pulled over twice. Nigga, in one week. Like, that shit was crazy. That shit was crazy. But, I mean, it is what it is, man. You know what I'm saying? Can't, can't even, can't do nothing about it. But, next time I, next time I, now I just...
Yeah, I'm trying to tell these niggas to pull over. <laughs> pull over in this motherfucker, man! Pull that big bitch over! <laughs> Okay, well, that wraps it up for today's vlog, man. Shit was crazy. Almost went to jail, went to jail for the second time in a week, man. And then on top of that, didn't catch no fucking fish. Drove all the way out to fucking Georgetown Lake. Caught nothing, but, I mean, it was a beautiful view. Wasn't worth about to go to jail for it, man. But the cops were pretty cool. I was going to record and, you know, I mean, show you guys the whole interaction, but I was not trying to put... Give them no extra, no nothing to say, nothing about nothing. You know what I mean, it was already bad enough that I was already talking the little bit that I was. But, uh, yeah, you know, just count your blessings, man, because people definitely have it worse than you. So, you know what I mean, I got a ticket, and it could be a lot worse. I could have went to jail, so, you know what I mean, I can't, can't complain, you know what I mean. I know I was in the wrong from the get-go. I should have, I was letting my homie drive, you know what I'm saying, I should have just let him drive. It was just at the at the spare of the moment. I was like, yep, let me drive to the next uh, fishing spot. And sure enough, motherfucking cops pulled up right after I hopped in the car, man. That's how, that's just how God works for me. You know what I mean? So that just shows, that just proves to me already that I already knew that, I mean, I just got to stay on my P's and Q's because that's just my luck. You know what I mean? But uh, like I said, that's it for today's vlog. See you guys on the next one.